welcome to uh, Lama Show in Birmingham, England today. Just gonna have a walk around at some of the new kit. It's a massive, massive place, so I'm sure there's plenty to look at. Let's go. Stuart Low Loader. It's like a little construction dump trailer as well. Ooh, found the first digger. Just seeing if the paint's gonna fall off like it does on my one, but they don't undercoat it. And then after about a year, all the paint starts flaking off. All the solid wrap in the back of here. Baylor wrapper, got the wrapper on the back. all the string. Start. Okay. Okay. How about this for a Cornish pasty? That's my breakfast. Mm. It's been restored really, really good as well. These are the people who do my gates, weren't on security. Good quality gates, never had any problems with them either. That's good. Dalbo. Agri Weld Stand. All well built stuff. This 
straw, right? Big bad cat, these toys are as tall as me. On Braco, these are the people who supplied all the concrete panels for the new shed and all the other sheds. Trenching chain. Putting drains in. Who's this bloke here? Dry, it's the south, the east. Reckon we, we have to be. Look who I've just met, Farmer P. <laughs> Greetings from Lama. Hello. If you haven't watched his YouTube videos, go and have a look, very interesting. Yeah, and likewise, if you haven't watched his videos, go and watch them, because they're even more interesting. The Deutz. I think they're German, aren't they? Biomass wood pellets. All but this is to make all my buckets and everything I've got. I've got a couple of straw make bits though. So. Bed now. Not busy on this stand. <laughs> Massive machine, isn't it? Everything's all very, very shiny. Cargo Taliander that we had last year um, for the grassland demonstration that we did at my yard. It's where the cab raises right up. It's all right, a bit big and heavy, really. So this is some of the grassland kit that we've had on the farm last couple of years. I think it's coming again this year, where we su we supply the fence with sort of fields for like driver training, so we so they can come and do all the training, you know, training all the dealerships up on how to use all the new equipment. So I haven't done any videos on it yet, but this year I will do a video on it. So we get on quite well with the fence lot, real real decent bunch of blokes as well. Is a Macdon flexi draper headers. Whole thing bends. I've done a couple of uh, jobs for Macdon. They're a real decent bunch of chaps as well. Made in Winnipeg in Canada. Very nice. Mikhail. Everything's very nice and clean. There's two four five, same as my old one. I've now got two six five. 
7S180, that'll be the one changing next for the 7718. Just change the paint colour slightly around here. Big sugar beet harvester. These concrete and power floats, we'll be using one of these soon to concrete the shed floor. If you're over here, we use two of them and then one ride on like this, which you'll see in the coming video. The Ohio State University. Can you imagine driving one of these combines from Texas to the Canadian border? There you go. There's the number if you want to go abroad doing combining. So these are the pedestals that are going in the new shed. Like that one there, look. Oh, this is what it looks like when it's actually set up. Got this little red bit on top. These are the fans that go outside. They sit out the floor like that. There's a big bucket on the front of this, man or two. A Merlot. It's got a Deutz engine in it. Just been had a chat with these guys who do these steel tables for welding on and uh mate colin he's got one and he's really pleased with it so i've just been and said thank you very much to them to tell them how good it is Wait and see this bloke here, look. So there we have it. Bit of an insight of walking around Lama Show 2023. Hope you've enjoyed it. Subscribe.